After dentists were forced to close their practices at the height of the pandemic, there are concerns missed appointments could come back to bite many Australians. There's a huge backlog of people who need a checkup, and experts say the delay could have long lasting impacts. With dentists forced to close for months for all but the most urgent cases, regular checkups were cancelled. I did have a dental appointment that was cancelled. I was quite worried if something did happen through lockdown that I needed to get to the dentist straight away. A delayed diagnosis could lead to worse outcomes and more invasive treatment. All our clinics are full. It's challenging because we want to get back to the routine care, the, the focus on prevention. And with mouth cancer, the seventh most common form of the disease in Australia, it is feared the population's dental health is now a ticking time bomb. We know that early diagnosis of cancer is really critical to good successful outcomes, so a delayed diagnosis or a misdiagnosis has some really potentially serious consequences. A study of the impact of COVID-19 on vulnerable children found an almost 87% drop in access to Medicare-funded dentistry nationwide. That resulted in almost 900,000 fewer treatments compared to the previous year. There's no doubt that it's applicable to what was happening across dental practices around Australia. Dentists fear so many Australians missed out on their regular checkup last year, there'll be more pressure placed on public waiting lists because of the amount of people now needing overdue treatment. Prior to COVID-19, the waiting lists in the public dental sector are around 19 months. And I think we're going to be really concerned over the next six to 12 months about what's happening in the public dental sector. Arrange that visit because it is so important and it will avoid more complex treatment down the track.